The desert of Wadi Hattan is also known as the Valley of the Whales because the fossilized remains of over 400 ancient whales and sea cows have been found here. Some of the skeletons are 50 feet long and date back 37 million years to a time when a shallow sea covered all of northern Egypt. Even more unique is that these whales had feet. According to an article in the Smithsonian, the whales of Wadi Hattan had evolved to the point where they could not return to land and feet eventually became fins. This UNESCO World Heritage Site has 13 individually marked fossils seen on a walking path that usually takes anywhere from two to three hours. You follow a marked path and just keep on going. Absolutely fascinating. The backbone of number two. Life and death on the shoreline. 400 skeletons 400 of ancient skeletons. whales and sea cows. And the fossilized roots. So, uh, these big chunks right in front of me, then. Those, the those are the mangroves, the fossilized mangrove roots. Hmm, hmm, hmm. This was the bottom of the sea where we are right now. This time there was a slow accumulation of whales. It died naturally of old age, disease, uh, hundreds of thousands, hundreds of thousands. This is what you were asking about. Yes. Okay. Prides, all right, they probably died naturally of old age, disease, stranding by tides, or predation by other whales. Continue. And it says also prevailing winds may have concentrated carcasses of dead whales by blowing them toward the shallow mangrove line bays. The landscape. Really beautiful. The pieces that have fallen off. That bridge over there is where it was mangrove, that great big rock. Not the little tiny ones in the middle. So we're supposed to see if we can find any whales or see where the mangrove layer began or where the whale bones or the fossils are. This is the most complete out of the 15 pieces that's on display. 13. Th uh, pardon me, out of the 13 pieces that's on display. That shows the whole length. Okay. And that would be considered a small whale. And then, Has been During evolution, when they first started walking on feet. Basilosaurus, is that how you pronounce it? Yeah. Nobody's here but us.